All right, hello everyone. Uh, I wanted to put together a quick, brief tutorial video here um, because I've never, um, you know, made a post about this topic that was, uh, you know, based solely on this. But I wanted to go to the Facebook group real quick. Um, and for all of you who don't know, uh, that Facebook group is Learn or Burn. And here it is right here. Um, you can find it uh, just by, you know, using a Facebook search at the top and typing Learn or Burn. It should be Golf Clash Learn and Burn. And it should be right there. This is the group that uh, me, Kevin Warren, and Steve Taylor uh, run together. And I just wanted to briefly touch on some of the features. So when I go to, uh, you know, the posts here, um, I can scroll down and, you know, all the most recent materials going to be at the top. Here is some Tor 11 stuff right here. So, um, you know, you can, you can use searches um, at the top of the bar up here, search. Um, so, for instance, if you wanted to find my posts, uh, you could just go ahead and search for my specific posts. And here would be some of my content right at the top here for you guys. Um, I also, you know, have put together, you know, several tutorial videos. So, if I were to, you know, type in things like Tor 10, for example, um, anybody who has used the Tor 10 tag... Uh, in a post um, and when I click on one I can show you exactly what it looks like we have a uh, uh, a certain guideline here you can see um, Peter here he says tour 10 um, and he puts the uh, cliffs course and also the hole and that it's a par 3 and uh, addition to that he puts the club that he used a Goliath 6 for example and a kingmaker ball and then he just briefly talked about his method for going about uh, his shot and uh, putting those tags in the video are what allow me to search for it at the top in the bar so we've really been encouraging the members to make their posts like this you know if you always put for instance the tour and we can go to mine real quick here's one of mine um, I, I did this very briefly just to show you guys um, how simple it can be. So all I did was I put Tour 10 at the top, Juniper Point, Hole 1. Um, it is a Cliff Par 4 here, and I just put that in there. Um, I also used a Rock 8 for my tee shot and an England ball. So um, additionally, you know, I broke down the shootout and showed that I it was... Um, You know, that first hole from the tournament from from a while back, and I used a Rock 8 on it. So if you were to use any of those words and needed to find this post or any similar post, um, you can use the search bar at the top to go about doing that. So that's one of the reasons that we're encouraging the members to post like this is so you can find, you know, not only my shots but other people's. Um, another thing that you can do, uh, for example... Um, if you wanted to find uh, a POC 4 shots, for example, um, anybody who has posted an POC 4 shot, you'll be able to scroll through the post. And here we can go directly to this. This is from the tournament uh, with a Berserker ball. So you're going to see this shot here. And, uh, you know, it'll, it'll just be helpful to be able to see your... Uh, you know, fellow members uh, hit these specific shots. Um, another thing you can do is, you know, this is hole one of the tournament. I can use, you know, hole one, for instance, as my, as my search. And that's one of the reasons that, uh, you know, we're encouraging people to do this is so you guys have a database. Now, eventually, the ultimate goal here is we are going to get the all the holes that you guys are posting and all the ones that, you know, um, some of the members post. And, you know, another thing that I can do if I wanted to find, uh, 
you know, some Kevin Warren videos, for example. Um, I could just type his name at the top and find, you know, a lot of, he, he, he does a lot of individual whole posts. So you'll see a lot of his, and it'll say, you know, pro division, for example, hole seven, hole eight, hole one. And, uh, you know, you can find the posts that way as well. So uh, one of the biggest reasons and tools that we're, you know, encouraging you guys to do is to, um, you know, post your shots like this. And uh, one of the things that we've also been doing is we've doing a tournament post of the day. So when I go to the group, for, for instance, if I go to the very top of the group, and here you can see view pin post. So the pin post is a user submitted post from yesterday by Jason. And, uh, you know, he, he put um, two different approaches that he used and showed basically uh, the error between the one method and the other. So, um, you know, just keeping these um, search criterias and, uh, you know, keeping the format of um, all your shot information can be a useful tool so members behind you can come and find this stuff. And uh, as I mentioned, you know, we've been running this pin post promotion throughout the tournament so Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday Sunday all the members that have been um, following the correct format to post um, and I can show you uh, basically you know this is a general statement on the criteria that we've been using uh, if you just put you know a brief video um, the course or tournament for example uh, the whole number, club, and level, uh, ball used, and then just brief description. You know, it can be a paragraph, it can be four words. Um, you know, just something that just shows that, uh, you know, that can be useful for the person that comes behind you. And again, it's not a required format for the group uh, to make posts. It's just basically a suggestion um, because of the fact that you know, that's how people are going to learn. They're going to be able to search for your posts or my posts, for instance, and uh, be able to learn something that way based on, uh, you know, something that you did um, could inspire somebody for their shot uh, in their tournament. So um, just wanted to basically briefly touch on that and go over the search features. You know, there's not too much left um, in terms of the uh, the search feature, but if I was to just scroll down um, through the through the group here, this is you know last to comment basically rises back to the top. So you know everything's going to be organized based off of you know the last comment that has been made. But uh, you can see as I scroll through down here that there's several user based tournament shots that have been posted and uh, I can just show you you know all the support that the community here is given um, for various methods for you guys to watch there's hole 5 here's some tour 11 here's hole 4 rough bump shot um, here's my post which was basically some expert bracket shots where I basically took suggestions from your community members and basically just said, okay, post what clubs you want to see. Um, if you guys haven't seen this, um, I can just scroll briefly down. I, I posted my bag, I posted the balls, and basically just said, hey, uh, you know, write some comments in here and uh, pick some balls, pick some clubs, and I'll pick something and do it for my round. Um, and, uh, you know, just scrolling through here, you can see uh, all, the, all the different scenarios here. There's an Amazon shot on eight. <clears throat> and, uh, you know, just scrolling down through here, we can see uh, all different kinds of, uh, you know, approaches and shots. 
here's a uh, looks like maybe just a tour a tour shot I don't know maybe this is a pro it could be a pro pro win there and uh, you know you can see the various posts uh, you can either scroll this way or you know using the stop the, the, the top bar at the top for the search feature you know anything that you want to search for for example if I want to see you know berserker shots stuff that I can do with my berserkers then I can just type in berserker and I can see uh, a wide range of approaches uh, whether it be this tournament or uh, you know another one another thing I can do is maybe you know KM balls for instance Kingmaker so um, the only thing you know I can stress is you know spelling's important so uh, you know if you spell something wrong uh, it will not be searchable so just something to keep in mind and think about but uh, just wanted to briefly touch on that just to give you guys a brief demo video and if you guys are interested in joining you know feel free to do so as uh, you know this is a very informative group in terms of you know learning and uh, you know improving your rounds on the game and uh, so you know whether or not I'm going to continue to make content or not there's going to be people that follow me in my footsteps or so to speak and uh, you know take it upon themselves to do you know great things so um, you know good luck with your guys around and uh, hopefully uh, I see you guys soon and let me know how uh, your progress is going feel free to comment or subscribe or um, also you know join the group and uh, you know, share your great shots or at the very least, you know, come and learn. So hope to see you guys later and uh, take care.